Philip Borowicinen. Fire away whenever you're ready. If you want also, when you uh, ask questions, just introduce yourself so he knows who he's talking to the first time here. Jason Shear with Wildcat Authority. I guess the, the obvious question, how's it been since you arrived? Uh, can you repeat, please? How is it? Have you enjoyed the experience so far in Tucson? Oh, I came here like about two months ago, and uh, I have great experience here. I feel it's really good, and I have fun. And that's it, yeah. When did Tom, Mike Luke from PHNX Sports, when did uh, Tommy Lloyd start recruiting you? I'm not sure when they started recruiting me. It was like about September last year, and yeah, we started talking there. Did you know at that point you wanted to go to college? I'm sorry, first pass go with the Arizona game. Sorry. Did you know? Did, I mean, because I didn't know. I mean, from Europe, did you uh, expect to go this the college route, or you know, at what point? I I wasn't sure I will go to the college, like, but. Uh, when I made the decision, I thought it's better for young players to play here in a uh, college, and it's uh, easier than playing in Europe. Trey, Mr. Sam, go easycats.com. Was that recruiting, was it a long recruiting process with Tommy? How did, how did that transpire and how did that go? Yeah, we talked, uh, I talked with uh, Coach Murph almost every day and with Tommy very often, and uh, it take it take a long it took a long way to my recruiting process. Yeah. Um, a lot of other recruits that, that have come over from Europe, they talk about they knew how to recruit European players. Did you feel similar that they weren't kind of too pushy? They gave you your space and let you, you know. Yeah, it was really great. I, I feel like uh, I had really great like uh, relationship with Tommy and uh, Murph, and yeah, they gave me space and. Was there other, I, I saw something, I think, was it uh, Texas Tech and Xavier you were also looking at? What other schools, was that true? What other schools were you kind of thinking about going to? Yeah, I talked with uh, Texas Tech, Xavier, uh, a little bit with uh, Georgia Tech too, and uh, some EuroLeague teams and some G League teams too. Okay. What's it like to try and evaluate, I mean, especially the, the U.S. college teams all, you know? You know, when you're over there, like, you know, Xavier compared to Arizona or Texas Tech, like, how do you figure out? I feel like uh, Arizona is, like, uh, one of the best programs in the country, of course. And uh, uh, compared to Texas Tech, uh, I, had, I, I had a really great relationship with uh, Coach Tommy and Murph, and I started believing them when I was talking with them, and that's why I chose Arizona. I'm Justin Spears, the Arizona Daily Star. Nice to meet you. Um, who was your main recruiter at Xavier? Uh, I talked with Sean Miller, yeah. Okay. And uh, are you familiar with the uh, Serbians playing at Arizona in the history of that? Yeah, I, uh, I met uh, Dušan Ristic here. He came here like about a month ago, I'm not sure exactly. And uh, we went to some lunch and he's a great guy, yeah. I've heard about Ivan Rdenovic too, but I have never met him. Him before. And what, what did you take away from that conversation with, with Dusan? Uh, I think he helps me a lot. He prepared me, but will, uh, but will I have like how, um, how will like practices uh, be here and everything with uh, Coach Chris rounds and uh, he prepared me for yeah everything here. Did he set you up a good place to eat or anything like that? Uh, you have a place to go around town? Mm, not really much. He m met me with some people, some guys from uh, uh, Tucson who is Serbian guys, but not. He didn't show me like some place to eat. How do you see yourself fitting into Tommy's system, and you know how you're going to integrate into that? Do you think like about the role or my role or what? Role or just you know the type of player you are, how that fits to his system. Uh, I think uh, I can I can fit great here because I can uh, shoot, I can pass, I can play off the ball and down ball, and uh, about role I don't know which role with Coach Tommy gave me this year, but whether if it's going to be like supporting team from the bench or playing in the game, scoring baskets and assists, I'll try to give my best to help team win the games. How would you say from what you've seen two months here the system that? Tommy runs compared to what you're used to uh, with your club in Serbia or anywhere else for that matter? 
uh, I played like I can say a matter league in Serbia. It's here is of course so much athletic guys, so much faster and everything. So I'm trying to use to it to get used to it. And coach Tommy changed a lot of things in my uh, in my game. So in the beginning it was really hard, but I feel now I'm getting better every day. What are, what are some of the things that you changed? Uh, he was trying me to like uh, when I first came here, I pass a lot of no look passes and everything. He tried me to uh, play simple, more, more simple, or on two feet, and yeah. Was there? I mean, is there a similarity in you know the, the amount of screening he uses or anything like that to what you've seen before? Have you seen any? Uh, we in Serbia we played like I played with a lot of with ball and it was like uh, everything around me. I was playing with ball and. It's just me playing pick and roll. Here is like everyone playing. Uh, you are sometimes off the ball, on the ball, and it's not that similar. But I'm trying to get used to it. Well, one thing I think uh, some of the coaches were saying about you is that you're kind of like a, a real basketball junkie. They call it, you know, call it over here. Watch a lot of basketball. It's just to kind of watch other games. Do you watch? Did you, growing up, did you watch a lot of NBA and, and college here? In yeah, when I was growing up, I watched the, like. College basketball not that much when I was really young yeah. because I didn't know for that. I was watching like only March Madness yeah. because we didn't have where to watch uh, in Serbia. We didn't have like channel for that. But the NBA, I watched a lot of NBA. Yeah. What would you say the basketball scene is like in Serbia? How would you describe basketball over there? Just I think basketball in Serbia is it's not like uh, athletic guys like here, but we play with uh, guys who are from Serbia play with a lot of IQ and. Uh, can, they can shoot, they can pass, they can dribble, yeah. Have you been watching any of the, the Euro games right now? Yeah, I, I watched all games of Serbia and a lot of games like other. I watched Curb, Lake for Estonia too. Yeah. So are you going to win that thing or undefeated so far? Uh, I don't know, will we win that, that championship? We are some of like candidate for championship, but I'm not sure we'll win that, yeah. Have you ever played in with any of those guys on that senior team? Uh, no. And then how would you just describe uh, Kirk Krisa as a player? How can I describe Kirk Krisa? Like yeah, a player? Just, just watching him or just practicing with him, what's he like? I think he's a great player. He has great energy. He can do everything on the court. He can shoot, pass the ball. And uh, he helps them a lot with his, his energy, I think. So. So you mentioned you, you saw some of the March Madness. Had you seen Arizona? Did you get to see their games this year? or uh, Last year I watched almost every game of Arizona, yeah. Last year. yeah. But before that, no. Did that have an impact on your decision to come here as far as the watching them play those games or the style? Or yeah, I think, I think Tommy, Tommy's uh, style of play is not like usual American style. He, he knows how to do with the European guys, and he has a lot of international guys in his team. So, yeah. Do you watch them live, or do you watch Because the, they played a couple of, I think, kind of later games. So it yeah. like early in the morning. I watched only the last game against Houston live. All, all other games I watched like later. Yeah, because. What do you like to do outside of basketball? <laughs> like normal stuff. I would like to hang out with friends, watch movies, shows, playing video games, listen to music. What are some of your, your favorite shows or movies that you like? Shows? Yeah. Uh, I watched uh, one of my favorite shows is. Mm, how do you say it? It's. Uh, Money heist. Money heist. Yeah, I don't know. Did you hear about that? But. Yeah. And what about movies? Uh, my favorite movie is Spider-Man for sure. I watched it a few times. I know almost every scene. And what kind? What kind of music do you like? Uh, I listen like a lot of Serbian music, of course. But when I came here, I started listening to Drake a lot. I like Drake. Do you play any other? Do you play soccer or any other sports as a kid growing up? Or? Uh, when I was really, really young, I, I want to start practicing uh, soccer, but my dad knew that I will be tall for that, yeah. and uh, because of that I started practicing basketball, and that's it, yeah. And then what about food? What kind of food do you like? Uh, my favorite food is chicken wings, but yeah, I like. Has there been anything in Tucson you've come across you've never tried before that you liked? Uh, yeah, I tried. I like uh, so much. I like uh, Native Grill. They have some great sauce yeah. for chicken wings. Yeah. What are, you, what are your favorite flavor of wings? Probably buffalo. 
What about like fast food? Do you like Del Taco or anything like that? <laughs> Bruce likes Del Taco. <laughs> I, I haven't tried it before. Right. Yeah. Okay. It's good. I like it a lot. Yeah. What about, uh, are you like a, a drums guy or flats? Like what kind of wing do you like? Are they the two different types of wings? Uh, I like flats. Flat. Flats more, yeah. Okay. And a ranch or blue cheese? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure about that, but it's right. And then just overall, I mean, I know you've only been here for a handful of months, but what's been the experience like just living in Tucson? Uh, different, big difference is that here is so much hotter than back in Belgrade, back in Serbia, but I feel it's really good here, yeah. Do you see yourself playing on the wing, like, solely? Do you have the ability to maybe go into the post a little bit? How, what do you think about that? Uh, if coach uh, want, wants me to play in the post, I can play. I think I can play too, but I'm most for that playing like backcourt, uh, backcourt, yeah. And who's a, a player that you looked up to growing up? Uh, Steph Curry. I looked up to him and now I like to watch Luca. Did you, you mentioned you watched a lot of NBA. Any teams you like or particular guys besides, yeah. besides Luca maybe that you've fallen over? I follow all the guys, but I like watching Golden State and Dallas the most. Anything else? All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Welcome. Yeah.